Hi there, I'm Dr. Dan from Genius Coaching. Vygotsky believed that we develop through our social interactions. And this makes perfect sense, doesn't it? After all, we've spent years learning from our parents, teachers, and even our friends. They've also had a big influence on us. It would be really hard to consider anything we've learned without someone's help. So let's look at three of Vygotsky's theories. First, we have the more knowledgeable other. This is simply a person who has knowledge or skills that we don't have. So for example, this could be parents, or it could be teachers, or it could be one of your peers, such as a classmate or one of your friends. Next, we have scaffolding. Now, as you can see from this picture here, scaffolding are basically platforms that workers use to reach the second or third floor. So what Vygotsky is saying here is that we use the more knowledgeable other as scaffolding, as a support that helps us to reach a higher level of development. Next, we have the zone of proximal development. So in the picture here, the first floor contains all the skills and knowledge you already have. It's basically anything you could do on your own without anyone helping you. The second floor, on the other hand, is the zone of proximal development. It's the level that's just above you that you can reach if you just have some help from someone from the second floor, one of those second floor more knowledgeable others. Now the third floor on the other hand, that wouldn't be the zone of proximal development because it's too high up. So for example, suppose someone on the second floor, a more knowledgeable other reaches down to give you some help. They can pull you up because they're just a little bit above you. On the other hand, if someone on the third floor tries to help you with a hand up, they can't because they're just too high up. Now you can reach, but it's just, it's too far beyond your level. So the idea here is there's a certain level of knowledge and skill that you're already capable of, but then one level up just above what you're currently able to do, someone can help you to get to that level. So you just need a little help there. So basically what Vygotsky is saying here is that we use the more knowledgeable other as scaffolding that allows us to learn within the zone of proximal development. So that's basically the theory. Thank you very much for watching and enjoy your day.